generals gathered in their masses Just like witches at black masses Evil minds that plot destruction Sorcerer of death's construction What is good, fellas? Kalito Shaves is back and this is video number 40 and actually number 18th straight razor shave and for that <clears throat> I'm gonna be celebrating I'm gonna crack open an Elysian Space Dust, space, space Dust IPA yeah and this is the Oktoberfest Bush Gardens Virginia glass Synthesis, I believe, an Anheuser Bush product too. I think it was, they were acquired by them, according to DK. So, cheers, fellas. Mmm. Yeah. And the Franken shave. If you saw the thumbnail, I'm gonna be using purely, purely skinful products. I'm gonna begin with the Renegade, which is a Deer Tallow soap. This, this is just, and the scent on this. Yes, speechless. Really love Linda Jane's uh, products. Tobacconist, this is a, a beef tallow soap. See the description in which I will be describing all the uh, all the uh, aromas and um, scent profiles is, is this is just masculine scents very appealing to me are very uh, from they're not I think it's they're like a six or seven in the scent scale scent strength scale and this is last but not least the Barbaric, I've used it in the past, this is Bear Tallow. <laughs> Great stuff. I'm gonna be using the matching aftershaves for each soap, plus another curveball, which is gonna be a cheapie that I just acquired right after I, um, I finish my shave. I'm gonna be using, to mow down all the hairs, I'm gonna be using the Boker Sullingen King Cutter Blade. There you go. This is a 5 8 blade with a lather may whiskers paw edge. So uh, I just tried um, an edge that he put on my weight and butcher, and I'm going to be trying this one for the brush. West Coast Shaving Silver Tip Badger, 26 millimeter, in the honeycomb handle. And the whip of the lather and bowl is I'm gonna be reserve, you know, retaking the Pereira shave bowl. And start whipping the lather. Pretty busy morning. Doing here and there a couple of things. Not resting on my laurels. Got a lot on my plate right now. Yesterday was a great day. Got a lot done. No pre-shave. I'm gonna be using. Oh man. It's like a mix of goodness here. This is gonna be my pre-shave. Just gonna let it marinate on my face. So the goodness of the soap helps in uh, soften the whiskers. And yeah, man, this is getting a it's requiring a lot of water. So so how is your uh, Labor Day weekend, guys? Hope that it's uh, it's going good. Going fine. Man, this is great. 
I'm gonna be mowing down two days of growth. I'm gonna be taking it easy with the straight razor. So this is a small blade. And uh, I'm getting used to this uh, new uh, honing blade that I got from Paul. So yeah, let's do this, as you can see, this just lathers like a dream. Just watch a couple of videos this morning, because I've been busy doing some stuff. But I haven't, um, I've been taking the time to uh, check most of you on the YouTubers. So, um, first pass. And me, uh, I didn't got to grab a towel to, uh, so I'm gonna be right back. So here I am again, so let's uh, do this. see very well I'm gonna use a napkin As you can see it's mowing down those whiskers like it's nothing pretty excited because I uh, just learned that my uh, my racers got to Colorado and they're in the hands of, uh, of uh, my eBay bought racers and I just got a couple of months ago they're in the care of Guy Solis and the Shaving Chronicles on YouTube I wanna, I wanna try his edge. I know that uh, those veteran shavers had put a lot of effort in, in their craft, and I wanna, you know. I want to be part of that by trying their edges and learning learning everything that uh, that I can, so uh, I can be uh, I can be <coughs> proficient in the future. Like I said, this is my only my 18th straight racer shave, and I believe I'm uh, making some progress. And uh, the more I uh, practice become more competent and the more I watch and learn from on the people that know hey it's part of the journey right man I love this scent I'm gonna be do I'm gonna be doing that I'm gonna be doing this more frequently this Franken shaves 
Maybe there are none. <laughs> it's quite interesting. The, the mixture of scents. Because it's uh, smell like tobacco, smoke. I get a lot of scents in here. A little bit of rose, a little bit of uh, earthiness like vetiver and, uh, and patchouli. It's, it's very complex. Let me uh, get more water in here. Some mixture of the deer tallow with the uh, bear tallow and the beef tallow. Man, I got we got we have a stew here. Hell of a stew. Let's continue on. And of course, a sip of the beer. shave Man, can't go wrong start with this sign So I'm watching a couple of series on Netflix also, keeping myself occupied every chance that I get. What are you guys watching? So I finished Cobra Kai, which was amazing. And uh, I'm watching, I, I think I saw the Umbrella Academy. And uh, And now I'm watching Kingdom, which is a story about mixed martial arts, MMA. And uh, I'm digging it. I'm liking it. Trying to get myself occupied. Not not getting to uh, any sort of dramas or whatever. Just uh, yeah, man. So this sign. Thank you very much for the comments on the uh, on the pizza challenge. Um, pizza tag, I mean, video. Been responding to comments every chance I get. Man, it's so difficult. I need to practice this uh, this stroke. I'm just gonna do it like I do it always with. Uh, my dominant hand. Money bass. I am I'm amazed like how uh, Maddie does it. With just one hand he just flips from every part of his uh of his face. Like it's nothing. Huh?
Yeah. Uh, much shaking on my hand. I cut myself, all that shaking and stuff. Plus it's my fault because before this I was doing some exercise. I think my muscles are twitching. Just the way it is, man. It's becoming a hard ass on some things. What's up? Third pass, just to touch up a little bit. And continue. And it's almost so much soap. So much soap. Put more water in here. Labor Day, I think there's a lot of sales going on. Just spoke to Magic Mike on Instagram. Because I want to get into honing. And uh, give me a couple of, uh, look at this. Full of uh, all the soap that I have on my, my sleeve. Give me a couple of websites to check out in Canada. Got a couple of stones. Maybe checking them out. Now it has the uh, hydration factor. Well, man, the scent of this three soaps combined. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna be doing more Franken shakes. Matter of fact, I'm gonna be saving them for October. It's not over. Not over yet. Okay. Touch up passes. so hot está caliente muchachos it is hot it's hot because I have my hands full of soap Up there. More scars. I'm shaving with a, with a pirate's edge, so that's what you get. Scars. Aye. Great. Yeah. and do the Franken shave 
going to use this for the hell of it. Oh man, yeah. <laughs> I can feel the alcohol. It's like 99% alcohol and less than 1% something else. Probably glycol. And I used it because it's green and it's re you know, reminiscent of uh, Frankenstein's skin. So I'm gonna be using the barbaric. I'm gonna do like a concoction. Yeah, it's jumping around. I'm mixing everything together. Then I'm gonna use the renegade. This, come on, dude, get out. The squirts, and then the tobacconist. Actually, the tobacconist too. Yeah. There you go. Got a small concoction in there. I don't know if you can see it. No, it's. It's a lot. And then the other side of my face. Hmm. There you go. Frank and shave at his finest. Oh. And of course, you need to treat your hair. The whole face. Whatever. <sighs> there you have it, folks. Franken shave. Shave number 40. Straight razor shave number 18. And uh, very thankful for your comments, for you sticking around and watching my videos. And uh, very appreciative. Paul, you did a nice, nice work. Um, I uh, I stropped it when I got it, and I and I can see that uh, your edges are right on point. I, and you told me that you use uh, Japanese natural stones, so those are killer edges, man. So until next time, shave number forty-one and straight razor shave number nineteen. Calito shaves is out of the house.